You know, if you're kind of a weather nerd like I am, you would actually love something like this. They're inexpensive. And usually people overestimate the wind speeds, I think. You hear them talking about, oh, it was really windy, gusts up to 30. I think most of the time those estimations are wrong. With a wind meter like this, you can be exact. You know exactly what's going on. Anemometer. Couldn't have given it an easier name. Hey folks, I'm Steve. This is the BT Meter Digital Wind Speed Gauge. What you see before you is everything that you get when you open up the contents. It comes with batteries. They do include a little screwdriver and just install those in the back of the meter. It's very simple to use and that's what I was looking for. You simply press the red button to power it on and you've got these buttons to change the unit. Like right now I am in the mile per hour so I could click that, just push the button and change it. There's not, I like mile per hour, I'm going to leave it there. Also down on this button here you can change from Fahrenheit to centigrade. So it's 75.6 degrees in here right now. You've got a, a battery indicator right there. If you want to turn on the backlight, press the light symbol button. So it's just a simple, simple, and this little, uh, let me blow on it. Man, it doesn't take much to turn that. That's pretty awesome. What better place to check out a wind speed gauge than on the beach. All right, the wind is hitting me in the face right now. Let's just turn it on. So I've got direct wind, and right now it's reading up into the eight, eight and a half mile an hour winds. As you can see, we got 80 degrees. You know, if you're kind of a weather nerd like I am, you would actually love something like this. They're inexpensive. And usually people overestimate the wind speeds, I think. You hear them talking about, oh, it was really windy, gusts up to 30. I think most of the time those estimations are wrong. With a wind meter like this, you can be exact. You know exactly what's going on. Let me also say this, because of the frame rate of the camera, the video makes it look like it's the the propeller blades on the fan are not moving fast but that's only due to the camera uh, i cannot see them spin they are spinning super super fast so just be aware of that okay i can definitely recommend this bt meter wind speed gauge i think it's awesome now i've always guessed what the wind was but now i will know for sure i hope you found the video helpful